All right, all right, all right, all right. Welcome back. Hey, hey, hey. You're kicking it in the kitchen with Mo Wright, your belly style, your better lifestyle, cooking, eating to live right here on YouTube. Hey, today we're going to do some fish. Fish. There's so many ways to cook fish right now. I have some basa. Some people say basa, but it's basa. I've cleaned my fish. Well, kind of rinsed it off. Letting it blot dry on my paper towel there, but this is basa. It's kind of a, it's in the catfish family. Uh, was was good about this this style of fish is a lot of people worry about mercury. Uh, you would have to consume a whole a boatload of this fish to even be worried with a mercury thing. These are one of your fish that are very 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 low. And mercury. So, just want to tell you that because pe some people are scared to buy fish from fish markets. But do your research on your fish. You know, just do your research. You'll find out what fish is good for you. But anyway, we're gonna make some fish. And I'm gonna tell you, I bought some fish. I'm not gonna call the name of it, but I bought some pre-breaded fish from the grocery store and tried to cook it in my air fryer. It was crap. I'm gonna tell you right now. It was crap. I don't care if you cook it in an air fryer, cook it in an oven. I don't care if you cook it in a million dollar freaking kitchen. I'm going to tell you right now, it's still crap. I'm going to put, see this little picture right down here in the bottom. This is the crap that I bought. Do not buy this crap. You are better off breading some cardboard and feeding that to yourself and, and your kids. Do not buy this crap. It's more bread than anything. It's a thin piece of fish and you're paying top dollar for this crap it's a thin piece of fish inside of this mess it's crap don't buy it it's not healthy for you at all for you nor your kids but anyway go ahead to the you know local grocery store or the fish market get you some fresh fish let's do it this way all right we're gonna do it your belly style i got my fish right here okay I have my fish blotting boom 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 sharp knives Play a key role. Alright, let me see. How do I want to cut my fish today? Sometimes you can go this way. Create some nice strips. I'm going to go sideways on my fish. Alright, I'm just going to go sideways on my fish. Alright, next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take me... Boom. I'm going to take me one egg. Take me egg here. I'm going to crack that into my bowl. All right, I bet you I don't have my whisk. I should have known I didn't have my whisk there. All right, grab me a fork here. And what I want to do, I got my egg. Uh, I'm just reaching for stuff because I want to go ahead and show you how to cook this. Plus, I cooked it earlier today because I was hungry when I got off work. I put me a couple of dashes of soy sauce in my egg. All right. And I just want to whisk that up real good. That's all I'm doing. Whisking my egg up real good. Boom, boom, boom. I'm going to let that sit for a second. The kind of seasoning I am using. This is New Orleans seasoning fish fry. All right. It's a cornmeal style um, breading for fish. Okay. It's just a breading mix. That's all it is. But it has that nice New Orleans seasoning to it okay but along with that even though i'm using that what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna sprinkle my fish with a little garlic salt do, 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 do. family favorite obey seasoning man i remember whoo growing up in dc and we this stuff stayed in the house because we were crab crazy all right I'm going to sprinkle a little Obey on my fish. Now I'm just going to take my fish, people. Boom, boom, boom. And I'm going to put it in my egg. Alright. Got it in my egg. All I'm going to do, I'm going to stir this around a little bit. Boom, boom, boom. Mix it up in my egg. Like I said, it's just a dash of soy sauce. Got some Obey. I'm using a New Orleans fish batter. If you don't have that, get your little cornmeal. Go maybe 
two thirds cornmeal, one third flour. Add your seasoning yourself, just a little bit of salt, some black pepper. Uh, you can add seafood seasoning to your batter. All right, got that. We're good to go on our fish. All right, we're good to go. Normally I use a regular old bag from a grocery store and I'll pour this in the bag, but so some of you people don't see me get too country. All right, gonna take my fish right here. Put my fish in batter. You know what? I don't mind getting my hands dirty. I let the egg drip off a little bit. I'm gonna put it in the batter because I want each side to lay kind of flat in my seasoning. So at least I know I got one side breaded. Just right, just right, just right. Boom, boom, boom. All right. I'm gonna put this in my container. Like I said, I'm just using a container for you pretty people. Normally I use a regular old grocery bag for food line and pour this in the bag and batter it up because I'm old school like that. But this is just for the pretty folks. All right. This is just for the pretty folks. All right, we got that nice and battered up. Gonna take out my tray. Boom, 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 I got my nice battered up fish. All right, I'm gonna lay my fish in here. And you can cut these slices uh, just as big as you want them. As big as you want them. Small as you want them, you can cut them into strips. Make your own fish sticks. Uh, Cause I'm telling you, it, with the price you pay for that pre battered crap from the grocery store i'm telling you when you buy fish and it says 3.99 a pound or 4.99 a pound you're still coming out cheaper buying your own fish because those little bags with four or five pieces in them will run you six and seven dollars up to eleven dollars for some pre-battered crap it's a bunch of crap they ought to be ashamed for selling that crap uh, that's why I'm trying to show a lot of you, hey, how you can cook better and save some money, eat healthy without buying all that crap. Because it's just crap. People pay for convenience, but that convenience will kill you. All right, there's, there's my fish. It's battered up. All right, we put it in the air fry here. I'm going to put this on air fry 10 minutes. I'm going at 370 degrees. Going to let that preheat do its thing all right we'll be back in just a second with some nice fish strips your belly style you're right we're back we're back uh it's almost time to turn our fish all right it's gonna be for me in just a second like i said i'm using the instapot all right um vortex fryer air fryer uh like i said i got this from target i have two of them because uh, I like to cook my veggies and my meat and have them done at the same time. But a um, hundred bucks, Target, I'm telling you. I've used my stove once in the last month and that was to cook you the Spanish omelet on the stove. But I also showed you how to cook Spanish omelet uh, in your air fryer. Okay, like I said, we're cooking fish. I'm cooking bassa, which is a style of catfish. And like I said, stay away from that crap at the grocery store pound per pound you can get twice as much fresh fish instead of buying that pre-breaded crap because i'm telling you especially if you're diabetic or if you're trying to lose weight that stuff will hurt you it's all bread i'm telling you all right it's time to turn our fish definitely gonna do that i'll take oh don't that look good already look at that look at that look at that looking good I'm gonna turn my fish pieces over. Looking good, smelling good. Oh man, I'm telling you, it's nothing like hot fish. I'm telling you, and you don't need any grease. You don't need any grease. We're putting that back in. Air fryer. We'll be back in just a second. Kicking in the kitchen with more right. Your belly style. Your better lifestyle. All right. We're gonna let that finish. We'll be back in a second. Peace. All right, all right, we're back counting down with our fish. We've cut into small strips cooking basa, form of catfish. Like I said, eat healthy people. Buy your fish straight out, fish market, uh, compare foods, anywhere you can get some nice, 
fresh fish. You can cook any fish like this the same way. I just told chose Basa for the day. You can cook your croakers, you can cook your whiting, you can cook your bass, all styles. We're counting down, counting down. But like I said, it's cheaper, it's healthier. And thank you for tuning in. Please subscribe. Please subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss a menu, you don't miss a show, you don't miss a recipe. All right, we're on track to getting you healthy. I've lost seven pounds in the last 30 days. That is a lot for a man, trust me. And it's just by eating healthy with the help of my air fryers. Okay, we've got it going on here. Our food has come to an end. Yes, yes, okay. Tell me, I don't know what I'm talking about. Look at my fish. Nice, crispy pieces of fish. Tell me. That doesn't look delicious. Now people right now, a lot of people would break out the hot sauce. But this is me. I like hot sauce, yes. Don't get me wrong, I like it. But it's high in sodium. You just let me put a little bit of this on the side right here. I guess that's that uh, San Antonio coming out of me. But it's all good. It's all good. It's all good. Let's break off a piece of this fish. Look at that fish. Oh, Lord have mercy. Look at that in that camera. I'm even going to break it open a little for you. Look at that. People, look at the steam coming off that nicely cooked breaded fish. Look at that. You see that in the camera right there? This is my thing. You want to get cute and eat what a fork is on you. Mm-hmm. Nicely breaded, crispy, cooked through and through. And this is some good meat on some fish, I'm telling you. This meat on this fish is perfecto. Perfecto. This is me. Your better style. Your better lifestyle, sorry. Your belly style. Eating to live right here with Mo Wright. Mo Wright favorite son. Thank you for tuning in. Please subscribe. Come back again. See what we're cooking next. Very good fish. Very good.